even if you uninstalled OneDrive, the icon might remain. You get an error message when you click it, but that doesn't change the fact the icon is there in the sidebar in the navbar of Explorer, so you hit Windows key and R. I'm referring to your keyboard keys. Windows key is right of control. All right, and in this window, you enter regedit. Reg edit. And in here you have to navigate a little. You have to open up H key class root and then you go down until you reach CLSID. You can type in the letters CLSID very quickly on the keyboard. Make sure to be quick. And you've opened it up. You fold it open. And now you have to find a key or let's call them folders that is uh, starting with squirrely bracket 018D5C66. Just the first few letters. Make sure to pipe type of the squirrely brackets will be enough to find this key and then you fold it open so you don't lose it. You can find the text at the bottom of the screen but also in the description of this video so don't worry about this. You should see three value pairs and what you're interested in the last one system is pinned that's what it starts with you can extend it system is pinned to namespace tree and you want to set this to zero so double click the name and just type in zero and press ok and if you go to Windows Explorer now you will see that it is gone. No more OneDrive folder. Let us just confirm that this actually works. We're gonna bring up Rugged it up again. Here we go. It luckily remembers the last position, otherwise you can use favorites. And we're gonna set this to one. And as you can see, OneDrive appears immediately, pretty much. If it does not for you, just close Explorer and start again and you will see the changes immediately. And we can play around with that and uh, yeah, show our dominance. We can even write a different value in, but only zero is really interesting to make this one disappear. And that's how you do it. If you are very frustrated by this, you can also change the name. Just rename it to whatever you want, the default value that is, and it will apply immediately. So you can show the computer who's the real boss in here. Isn't it great when you can make your computer do what it actually is supposed to do? Yeah. Just stick with me and you'll be disabling Windows updates in no time. See you next time. Ciao.